Hi, Tim Hunkard here. In this video, I'm going to look at installing Linux on an ARM-based Chromebook. Now, on this channel, I have a lot of videos on installing Linux on an AMD slash Intel-based Chromebook, but I picked up this Acer Spin 311. I got it off of Amazon, and it has a MediaTek Companio uh, processor, which is an ARM-based processor. So let's just take a look at that. If I go to settings here, and I pull up settings and go to about Chrome OS and look at diagnostics. Uh, I can see I have the MediaTek Companio 500. It's the MT8183. Uh, so that's the processor for this. Um, but I see here, if I want to go down uh, on about Chrome OS on the left side here, I still have this option to install the Linux development environment. So I'm going to click setup and then next. Uh, it's going to prompt me to have a username and give me a recommended disk size. I could go to custom and move the slider along here or just keep it at recommended. I'm going to keep it at recommended for now. Uh, if you did want to change your username, I believe you should do that now. Um, the disk size can be changed at a later point. I'm going to click install and I'm going to let that run through and go ahead and install and I'll come on back once that's done. Okay, once Linux has gone ahead and installed, the terminal will pop up. I'm going to maximize this and just increase the font size for you a little bit. And I want to make sure everything's up to date, so I'm going to type in sudo apt update, then two ampersands, then sudo apt upgrade, and do a dash y. Hit enter and run through. Okay, and it's run through. Um, one thing, I use the terminal a lot, so I'm going to right click and pin this to my taskbar. I can close out my settings at this point and you know I can start using some Linux apps. For instance in the terminal if I type in Vim I can go right into Vim here and begin working. Um, I guess that's uh, it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.